Yo, what's going on boys? Today I'm gonna to be playing some Hog 2.6 on top ladder. If you guys enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe and super fun deck to go back to. Hog 2.6 will never really completely die and it's always really fun to go back to because I have a lot of good memories linked with the deck. If you guys enjoy the video, once again, make sure to like and subscribe and the reason for that is because Hog 2.6 kind of taught me how to play all cycle decks back in the day when I was just now picking up cycle decks. I used to play like a lot of Hog 2.6. And that was when Oyasu and like people like Jack used to play it a lot, so I always have like a really fun memory linked to it. Okay, I'm gonna Musketeer in the back here. This guy's playing a Lava Hound deck, so should be a good matchup because I'm playing Cannoneer right now, so I think I'll be fine. Skeleton's at the bridge there to kind of bait out the guards because that would have taken out, I think, like half the tower right there if he ignored it. I'm gonna log on the right. The guard should die. The cannon's gonna pull the balloon. I don't know if I need a fireball. Man, even if I do, I'm not gonna play it because i'm gonna eat the one shot but instead i'm gonna go hog on the left here to try to kind of support the musketeer yeah the musketeer might get a lot of value here because i feel like you might have to go for like skelly drags or maybe something to defend the dual lane also evo skeletons are still really good in my opinion i don't really see like a difference on defense and maybe on offense like a little bit of a difference because they don't survive like zap and um stuff like poison anymore but they're still really good in my opinion let me know what you guys think of the evo skeletons in the comment I will say though, the Evo Skeletons are kind of like dying down on top ladder. I don't want to say dying down because they're still really broken, but you don't see them every game like you used to like say a week ago. Because I think Night Witch is really popular right now because of Cannoneer. Night Witch is like Night Witch can take out a whole tower on its own, by the way. So that's why it's really popular. And any kind of Evo Skelly's decks kind of get countered by like Bats and Night Witch decks. So at least it has like a counter now. Like it's, I don't want to say it's like not broken anymore because it is still really broken one of the best evos of all time but i feel like it has like a reality check deck now so anyway it's gonna musky in the back i don't even know if i worded that right but hopefully i did i'm gonna ice golem hog here actually gonna hog on the right because i feel like he might try to predict oh i thought he was gonna pre-valk or something on the left okay that's fine at least i baited out some elixir on the other side i'm gonna go for skellies here gonna musketeer in the middle to try to take out the mega minion so it doesn't hit my musketeer i'm gonna fireball the middle for the skelly drags Keep the muskies alive and then i'll just go for ice spirit okay keeping the musketeer alive right now i think he's zapped so maybe i could do like hog evo skeletons here i'll try to log too okay hold up wait go 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 no come on no the one evo skelly died that would have been sick if they just survived the entire valk and the skelly dragon went through the entire tower <laughs> could have been pretty funny but i'm gonna ask him high here he might try to zap yeah okay i'm gonna hog here i'm also gonna evo ice spirit for the valk Okay, I'm gonna log it too. All right, the guards are dead. I guess I could have like delayed the hog a little bit to try to get damage, but I think he still would have defended. The problem is Cannoneer takes out my hog pretty quick, so I need to like overcome it on offense every time to try to get it on tower. And even then, sometimes like he just full counters it with like guards or something along the lines of that. Matter of fact, I'm gonna predict them right now. Gonna hog and then log Ice Spirit. I think he's back to Evo Valk though. Oh, wait, wait, Ice Spirit freeze. Ooh, that's gonna be one shot, okay. I like that. He's probably going to lava at the bridge. Okay, I'm going to musky on the side. I need to be able to defend this somehow. Also, guys, if I sound a little bit tired, it's because I just came back from the gym. I hit back today, so I'm pretty cooked. Going to hog here. Also, yeah, speaking of gym, I do have a question for the people who do hit the gym. Um, What do you guys do for, like, the protein intake after gym? Like, what do you guys eat? Because I usually do Chipotle, but I'm kind of growing tired of it now every day, so... I need like a good replacement for it. I don't know what's like a high protein intake and um, also like not lacking on the macros or anything after gym. So yeah, just let me know in the comments what you guys intake after gym or even before gym. I know some people eat before gym, but I like to eat after because it doesn't make me feel bloated or anything. Okay, I'm gonna hog here and then I'll just go fireball. I need to fireball cycle. That might get a shot. Oh, the cannon here. Okay, I'm just gonna ice golem block the bridge. Cannon here to pull the balloon. Ice spirit back to fireball so i'm gonna fireball on the tower all right that was kind of a sweaty game for the first game not going to lie his cannoneer was defending the hogs pretty well but i'll take the win gonna hop right in i will see when i find a match okay i'm in my next match here facing leo heart val see what deck this guy's playing i'm gonna go for ice golem hog first play i'm gonna outskill this guy okay i'm just gonna ignore it maybe i can ice golem to kind of push it off and not take damage on the right though no i messed it up it's okay though i'm gonna get damage here oh he had to spend eight elixir for it Okay, it's always nice to bait out like a lot more elixir than what you placed on offense because you always like start off the game up elixir and then you can make a lot of like counter push and stuff. That was a really good bomber. I also didn't know that he had a bomber in the deck, but he might be playing rocket in the deck. I feel like it has a rocket and not poison because he has 
dark prints in there. So it kind of makes me think maybe he has like rascals and goblin gang. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, gonna log here. Hog should get like two hits on the tower. Nice. The only reason the hog got two hits right there is because the first hog baited out like eight elixir on defense. So he wasn't able to play like stuff on time for the second hog. Same with the next hog. I feel like it's not gonna get any damage, but the one after is gonna get like two hits again. I definitely could be wrong here, but that's kind of how it plays out in my head. Also, Evo Skellies are going to get a lot of value in this matchup because if he goes Goblin Drill alone, then I can drop Evo Skeletons on it. And then if he spends like a small spell to kill it, then that is like already like what, like six or seven Elixir from one Elixir. So I can always like pressure opposite lane at the same time, try to get a lot of damage and defend the drill with like a log maybe. I don't know if that made sense. I'm really bad at explaining these kind of things. So please let me know if like... I, I don't know, sometimes explain something really badly. I'm gonna go for a fireball and then I'm just gonna Evo Skellies on the left here. Hopefully no arrows or anything. Oh, Evil Bomber. I kind of forgot that he had an Evil Bomber. Not going to lie, but those should die on the Bomber. Oh, okay. I thought I had to log the Bomber, but yo, wait. Oh, unfortunate. Dude, that would have been so sick if it just went to the tower. <laughs> Kill the bomber, almost went to the tower, but I'll take that to be honest. I didn't have to log on defense, so that was pretty good. I'm going to cannon in front of my tower here to kind of block the goblin drill. Perfect. Not going to get any damage on my tower. I don't need to log or anything. Okay, I got two hits on the tower too. I'm going to go for ice golem here. I'll go log and then I'll go skeletons here. I'm back to my ice spirit now, so I guess I'll go ice spirit on the runners. And I'll try to go hog. Actually, no, I'll cannon here first. I need to defend the dark prince. Okay, Hog Rider now, and it is going to bait out like the defensive drill and maybe a LP. Nice, okay, perfect. Seven for four. I'm getting a positive elixir trade every time I go Hog. Okay, I need to Musketeer and then kite all this stuff away. Okay, this could be a bit of a problem, but I think I'll be able to defend all this if I play it good. Ice Spirit to keep the Musky alive. Perfect. Okay, yeah, that was good defense right there. I'm gonna log here. Make sure that the wall breakers don't try anything funny. Wait, I don't think he can defend my Evo Skellies. He just played arrows on offense on my Musketeer, right? So he's not back to it. Hold up, wait, go, 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 go. Oh, wait, are they on tower? Yeah, they're on tower. Wow, okay. <laughs> they went through a Dark Prince, a Goblin Jill, a Bandit, and went to the tower and took it out. Let's go. Evo Skellies are still so good, man. I can't believe it. The nerf actually did not do anything, but I'll take the win. Alright, I'm in my next match here. Facing Curry. This guy's a really versatile and really good player, so could be playing any deck. Let's find out though. Gonna hog first play. Okay, gonna ice golem on the side for the fire spirit. Um, still could be any cycle deck. Goblins, fire spirit, and a log. I mean, could be goblin drill, could be mortar, could be hog rider, could be anything. I don't really know yet, but zap. Okay, log and zap. So that means it is gonna be a deck without a big spell. Hmm. Still don't know what the win condition could be though. I'm going to respond to the knight in the back with a musketeer in the back. I'm actually going to skeletons at the bridge. No login cycle. He might have to fire spirit on it because th those actually do damage now. I love how like you have to defend skeletons at the bridge in 2024. I'm going to ice golem here to save my musky. He might try to pop ability. Yeah, let's go for the ability. I'm going to log here though. I need my musketeer alive right now. So, okay. Musketeer should stay alive. Yo, I kind of want to hog here. Okay. I'm going to hog because I feel like you might have to defensive building. Okay, so it is going to be Mortar. I still don't know if he has a Miner or a Hog Rider as the win condition. Because usually people play either one of those and I need to like actually find out. I feel like he would have played the Miner by now though. Not really too sure yet, but could be saving the win con for the surprise. I mean, I saw Moogie playing Giant in this deck with the Evil Mortar, so I don't really know. Could be anything at this point. I'm going to go for an Ice Golem on the side. I don't feel like eating the Fire Spirit damage right now. Okay, I could probably go for like a Hog and a Fireball here. Actually, wait, hold up. I'm going to hog and then Evo Skelly's in the middle. That way he's going to have to Evo Zap one side and then log the other side. Perfect. Wait, he might not have to log the other side because the Mortar is going to take it out. But he had to Evo Zap though. He couldn't play the Evo Zap on my tower. So I'll take that for sure. going to go for a log on the Knight to not take any damage. I'm already back to a Hog Rider. Kind of crazy. But let's see if I can make something happen here. going to go for a Hog and then see if I can get some damage. Actually, going to Hog opposite. He might try to LP in front. Oh, I thought he would LP in front of his tower. He's going to get the evil mortar on time now. Okay, thankfully though, that is not on my tower, so I don't really have to worry about the damage. But yeah, kind of unfortunate that he didn't LP and just went for goblins on the thing. The, what do you call it? The hog rider. Okay, I'm going to go for an ice spirit on the hog. I might take some damage here. I know that he has a... No, that was meant to be a log. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. That was meant to be a log. Okay, that's fine. I took one shot. Hopefully I don't lose the game off that. I'm going to go for a hog here. I'm just going to fireball. I feel like this matchup could be a little bit tough if I don't start fireball cycling like pretty early because 
I feel like at some point of the game, he is gonna break through. I can't do anything to stop his push at some point because Evo Zap takes out Cannon, gets a lot of value, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna be struggling on defense for a while, but gonna go for Evo Skellies here. Thankfully, though, I did keep up with this cycle for now. That was a quick zap, two LP hits, but it's okay. I need to go for a Hog Rider, and then I guess I'll Fireball again. Yeah, I'll just go Fireball here, gonna Evo Ice Spirit with it too. Okay. Not too bad. Evil Ice Spirit's kind of like a normal Ice Spirit in this matchup. Doesn't really do anything. Maybe freeze the hog for a little bit, but that's about it. I'm gonna cannon high so he can't zap on the tower and the cannon. Oh, he is gonna Evo zap the musketeer though. Okay. Alright, he's winning by a little bit. Oh, I don't like this. I do not like this because I feel like that mortar might lock on my tower if I'm not careful. Oh my god, I'm dead. Oh, that was such a good hog rider. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie guys, I feel like I'm kind of dead here. I need to rotate back to my log, and even then the hog's not gonna die anytime soon. I need to ice spirit. I need to go for a cannon to prevent the one extra shot. Come on, no. Alright, that was horrible. I knew at some point in the game though he would be able to bounce back and get the damage back and get all of it back, but I didn't think he would get that much. That was just a really good like evil mortar push right there. I need to fireball too because he might get a hit. Okay. Good defense. I'm gonna block the LP on Namaski. Nice. I'm gonna go for a log. Nah, actually, he's gonna pop the ability. I don't even need to log. I guess I will. I mean, he's kind of delaying the ability. I'm gonna go for a musky on the side. Ice Spirit as well. I'm gonna go for an Ice Golem at the bridge. I will go for a hog in the back. Bro, he's keeping the LP alive for 20 years and now he's gonna be back to Evo's. Oh, he had to play it on the right, actually. I, I didn't even see that. I missed it, but. Not too bad. I'm gonna fireball on the mortar. I'm not sure if I'll be able to still come back from this, but I will try my best. And uh, if I come back from this, you guys have to like and subscribe. I don't make the rules. I'm gonna go for a cannon here. I'm gonna skeletons high. I'm gonna log here. Okay, he's probably gonna hog or mortar. Something along the lines of that. I need to hog rider. I need to go for a fireball. Alright, I need to go for an ice spirit here to kind of keep the cannon alive for maybe a little bit longer. I need to log right now. He had to zap on the evil skellies at the bridge. Hold up. Hold up. Cannon over here. Distract the mortar and the hog. Fireball. Please do enough. Do enough. Do enough. No. I lost by one zap tick. No. No. Well, you guys don't have to like and subscribe, but I would still appreciate it if you guys did because that was honestly good effort to try to come back from that game. Gonna hop right in. Okay, in my next match here, facing Burke. See what deck this guy's playing. I'm gonna go for a Ice Spear in the back. I guess I'll put it at the bridge. I forgot that this guy does not have the cannon here. Okay, I'm just gonna go aggro. I'll just go hog. Oh, nice snowball. <laughs> okay, snowball, dark prince, and a bomber. Yeah, I wonder what deck this is, man. <laughs> I'm just joking. It is giant graveyard, so gonna be a decent matchup, I think, because I can actually defend with the normal towers. Okay, I need to skellies on the side and then maybe log the dark prince back to make sure that I don't take any damage. Clean. I'm gonna ice spirit again to try to get to my evo. Okay, actually gonna musky in the back. I don't want to hog into that because he could go for like an eye drag or something. He is playing the giant graveyard deck with a dark prince, so he could have like a skeleton army, maybe an eye drag in there too. So I need to be a little bit careful. Gonna cannon. Skeletons on the side. Okay, come on. Defend, 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 defend. Eye spirit. Ooh, that was a really valuable eye spirit. Took out like almost all the skellies in the back. That was really good. Okay, I'm still winning by a little bit though. I think I'll be able to win if I just defend good in single, because in double elixir, I'll be able to get back to like multiple musketeers on defense, so it won't be a problem, but it is kind of a problem in single though. I need to be like super, super careful. Okay, I'm gonna hog on the right and then keep the fireball ready. Maybe he has barbs or something. Oh, Archer Queen. And he cycled it in the back opposite. Okay, it's gonna be a hit. Let's go. Six elixir on a four elixir hog and it still got a shot and it's like 500 damage balanced. <laughs> yeah, but Ian does not want to hear about that, huh? I'm gonna go for Evo Skellies on the Queen and then I'll just go for, I guess, a log on the Queen. I'll eat damage on both my lanes. Kind of try to equalize it. Well, that was kind of a bad job of trying to equalize it. I guess I should have logged the Dark Prince, but it's okay. He can't defend the Hog here. Oh, imagine that Firebolt. That would have been a bit of an overcommit, though, I will say, but I don't think he'll be able to go in with a graveyard, so Firebolt would have been nice here. Would have been nasty. It's okay, though. Good defense on the Giant. <laughs> Looks like this guy's not too happy about it. Okay, I'm gonna BM this guy if I win. I hate Giant Graveyard players, man. I'm sorry if you guys play Giant Graveyard. I still love you because you know you guys are my viewers, but yeah, if you guys play Giant Graveyard and don't watch my videos, then I absolutely hate you. We got a problem, but don't worry. We could talk about these things that we can definitely try to fix the problem. <laughs> try to maybe play a different deck. Okay, I'm gonna Ice Golem. It's good that I baited out Tiba. What? 
Okay, thank you for the free King Tower activation. I don't know what the hell that bomber was, but I'm gonna activate King Tower when it gets to my side. Huh? <laughs> what the hell? I don't know if you guys saw that snowball, but he actually missed the hog rider. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna activate King Tower here off the ice column. Bro, this guy's playing so horrible. Classic giant graveyard players, I guess. Yeah, that bomber had no like point. Like literally played a bomber in the back just to give me a free activation. Because when I'm pressuring opposite lane, he can't like support the evil bomber, so I don't even know why he played it in the back. Gonna musketeer in the back. Okay, I'm gonna spam well played. <laughs> just gonna ice golem here. Oh man, this is so satisfying. Dude, I love BMing giant graveyard players. <laughs> can't in the back here. Okay, that's enough. I'm gonna end the game. Alright, wait, maybe I can get Evo Skellies on the tower though. Nah, he's not gonna defend the Musketeer. Oh, I was trying to stall it out for a little bit, but it's okay. Alright, good win. I'm gonna play a few more. I'll see you guys when I find a match. Alright, I'm in my next match here. Facing Demon. See what deck this guy's playing? Okay, hopefully not a Demon deck. Gonna go for a Hog Rider on the right. Zap and a Evil Bomber. Okay, could be Goblin Drill maybe. Tornado too. Huh. Not a good matchup though. I feel like he might have a building if it is Goblin Drill. Yeah, I think it's pretty safe to say it's a demon deck. <laughs> okay, let me stop being cringe. I'm gonna go for Ice Spear on the right. I guess I'll go Musketeer in the... Uh, actually, I'll go Skeletons at the bridge. Oh my god, it's Golem. Wow, love it. Golem in the back, let's go. <laughs> okay, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not trying to be cringe or anything. It is gonna be a demon deck. I hate Golem. I'm sure you guys know by now that I hate Beatdown. <laughs> okay, I need to cannon here. I need to go for an Ice Spirit to make sure that the cannon stays alive, but also takes out the Lumberjack. I need to make sure to play a Musketeer above my King Tower to get a lot of value off of it. Bit out like maybe a Tornado off of it too. Arrows, huh? Interesting. I'm going to go for an Ice Golem. I'm going to log this back to not take the Golem Death Bomb. All right, sweet. Ouch, that is a lot of damage. Maybe I'll try to activate King Tower here. Yeah, I'll try to get the king up. I'll just do this here to get the king up. I don't know why he zapped the middle. Maybe try to prevent the king tower activation, but I wasn't even back to Evo Skeletons. Hold up, wait, this could be tower. Oh, Lumberjack Rage is going to take it out. Maybe one of them lives, maybe? Go. No. Okay, well, that was good damage, though. Yeah, I feel like he knows it, too. This might be good game already. That was a really bad zap trying to prevent the king tower activation because I wasn't back to my Evo Skeletons, but when I was back... um. He didn't really have a spell for it, so he had to play a Lumberjack and just kind of ignore the Hog Rider. Okay, I need to I school him in the back here. I need to be careful of the Hog. Or not the Hog. What am I talking about? The Golem. Okay, Musketeer in the back. This cycle, he's not back to Evil Bomber, so I don't have to worry about like a snipe on the Ice Golem. I will try to play an Ice Spear on the Phoenix. Try to keep the Ice Golem healthy a little bit. Okay, I'm going to go Hog here. I'll just go Hog and then go Fireball. Okay, my Hog got pushed midair, but it's okay gonna get tornadoed probably oh he's letting it go okay i need to focus on the defense here i feel like i could defend this definitely gonna be tough but i could definitely like double fireball cycle on defense okay, i need to ice skull him i need to go for a fireball on all three and then i need to oh he's back to evo zap okay i think i choked the defense because the evo zap took out my musketeer i wasn't expecting my musketeer to die but maybe though come on fireball no i missed the evil bomber uh ice spirit no no, okay, wait, log, come on. Nah, it's a tower. I played a really bad Ice Spirit. Yeah, that was kind of a terrible Ice Spirit. I could have defended if I played a better Ice Spirit because the evil bomber would have died, but now I need to take out the second tower. Okay, tornado to the king tower. Um, Wait, the king tower is getting kind of cooked. Hold up, wait, I'm going to go for the king tower. <laughs> wait, for the jokes, I'm going to go for the king tower because I feel like I could actually take out his king tower. He's playing a golem deck. Yo, yo, wait, Ice Golem Pocket. Evo Skelly is at the bridge. Fireball on the bomber. I'm gonna overcommit like crazy because I know that it's gonna pay off. One more shot, one more shot. Give me that. Yes. Okay, wait. Hog Rider again. Hold up. Ice Golem Pocket. <laughs> Man, I don't even know if these are like good plays or not, but I'm just spamming at this point. I have to do something. Okay, pray for me on defense here because I feel like you might chuck another Golem in the pocket. Oh god. Okay, I need to Musketeer. I need a cannon over here. Oh, interesting E-Drag. I don't know what that was. Maybe he thought I was going to hog again. I wasn't even back to hog though. Okay, I'll go hog here because I feel like he might golem pocket. Yes. Okay, I'm going to go for a log. I'm going to cannon here to pull the golem away. I have two golems on my field right now. I'm going to go for an ice spirit. Oh my god, send help. Send help, send help. Uh, okay, that's good that it's on the E-Drag, by the way, because now I don't have to worry about the chain on my tower. I'm going to hog on the king tower. Okay, I'm going to go for an ice spirit. No, lucky arrows. Ah, I need to... 
Evil Skellies, come on, don't take my entire tower. Okay, I need to fireball. No, wait, Phoenix. No, I didn't see the egg. Ice Spirit. Okay, okay, I can fireball cycle, come on. Fireball on the King Tower, and then I need to get back to two more. Okay, I'm just gonna ice him. I feel like I could just hog and take the win right now, but I want a fireball second. I want to get back to two more fireballs. Stall out his push. Cannon here. Skeletons over here. Ice Golem over here. I'm back to fireball in one. I'm gonna go for ice bear on the side. Back to fireball. Gonna fireball on the king tower. Let's go. Oh my god. Okay, that game had no point in being that close, but I love you guys, and I will see you guys on the next one. Subscribe. Bye.